Welcome to the Daily Beer for June 18th, 2019. And okay, so I just recorded this whole video. Knocked it out of the park. Forgot to have my sound on and my microphones. <sighs> so here we go again. All right, so second take on bad Marlon Brando impression. I'm gonna make it an offer I can't refuse. Why am I doing that? Because I'm a godfather. Okay, so today is this. Look at little That is that right there. Let me just hold it right there. Look how cute he is. That is Malcolm Richard Tyrion Williams, who was born today. Um, so you mentioned you you might have saw my best friend, um, his name is Brian Williams, uh, on one of my videos. He's a he's been in one. I've talked about him in a bunch. Um, he's in BC right now, um, and. Uh, his third son was born today. <laughs> um, so again, Malcolm Richard Tyrion Williams. Tyrion, not from Game of Thrones, in case you're like, wow, awesome, cool. No, it's uh, from uh, Chronicles of Narnia. So anyway, um, so to get that out of the way. Okay, so he has three sons. I'm the godfather of two of them. Now let me explain why. And not three. Um, Okay, so when my daughters were born, both times, the first time my, my daughter Marjorie was born, we, we picked godparents. We're like, yes, you'll be the godparents, and you, you will speak into their lives, and that's what godparents are supposed to do. They're supposed to be around and remember them and be there and help them. And, and the two godparents we picked were, were really close friends of ours that within a couple of years had completely fallen away from us and didn't talk to us anymore. Not they hated us, it just they just fell out of our lives. It was sad. And then um, when Zion was born, we're like, we're gonna pick, we're gonna pick more. We're number one, the first time we picked people who weren't really that solid in, in their faith. So like, we're gonna pick people who are super solid in their faith. And this time we're like, we're gonna get this right. We're gonna, we picked a couple that were friends with ours. And then we picked two single people that were, we were friends with at church. And they're all really smart, good people. And we're like, you guys are the godparents of Zion. And almost the exact same thing happened. Um, yeah, they they just fell off. And not that they're not friends. Well, the couple I'm not really friends with anymore, but that's a whole other thing. But they just dropped off. And really, other than giving Zion a blanket, um, which her, her one godmother did, which she kept forever, and we have lots of pictures of, um, she didn't really speak into her life all that much. And that was what you're supposed to do. So because of that, when Joshua was born... Um, Brian's firstborn, he went, hey, we'd like you to be the godfather and godmother. Um, Beth, the godmother, not me. Anyway, um, <laughs> and I went, no. Didn't even consult my wife. Didn't even look at her. And just went, no. And my, my thought was, godfathers, godparents suck, so why would I want to do that? It was dumb. I was wrong. I was... <sighs> I was insensitive, and I, my, my, my wife got really mad at me. My best friend got really mad at me. And so thus, I am not Joshua's godfather. Sorry, Josh. You're awesome. Love you. Um, and it's my stupidity. And, um, yeah. So, fast forward a couple of years, Cormac's born. And Brian, me, me and Brian were also in a kind of weird place the first time. So, it was just like, I was like, no. Eh, no. Anyway, Cormac's born. And, and Brian just looks at me and goes, you're the godfather, by the way. And we're not. And I, I was like, oh, okay, I get it. I'm, I'm sorry. I apologize. Like, I'd already apologized before that. But, you know, he just, he didn't give me a choice on this one. He's like, you're the godfather. Um, and so I was like, okay. And and now Malcolm Richard Tyrion Williams, I keep looking because I'm terrible with remembering names, but I'll remember it, is born and I'm his godfather. Now he's in BC. I'm in Ontario. If you don't know Canada geography, it's way far apart. <laughs> like countries apart if you're in Europe. Massive country. We're like four countries apart in, in Europe. Um it's, it's the other, he's like literally, I'm, I'm more close, closer to the Middle East, and he's the furthest west you can pretty much go in Canada as provinces go. Um, so I, I haven't seen him, um, I, like other than pictures, and I won't get to for a while, but my, uh, my godson was born today. Uh, mother and him are doing good, apparently, and Natalie, she's awesome. Um, I'm, I just, I love this family. Um, I'm thrilled to be a godfather again. Um, 
I plan to speak into their lives a lot and offer insight, and that's what Godfathers are supposed to do. They're also supposed to make sure that they spoil them a little bit, which I have already, because you know I've given drum sets and things like you know that I'm proud of giving that were noisy. <laughs> so anyway, that's why the terrible Marlon Brando impression and and yeah. So again, Malcolm Richard Tyrion. Williams. I'm going to throw the last name in there. Happy birthday, bud. And uh, congratulations to mom and dad and brothers. So uh, that's it. Thanks for watching. And uh, God bless. Especially Malcolm Richard Tyrion Williams. So happy you're born. Have a good day.